While getting a little bit of history of how long the almond farm has been around, Ashley and Mario took me to see the unique equipment that is used to harvest their crop. So I think this is kind of maybe the perfect symbol between like where Mario's job as a farmer and my meat because uh, my products are what goes into this. Um, so this is a modern orchard sprayer, an orchard blast. Um, it's actually electrically charged, so it's where the molecules, when it comes out, they're more attracted to the leaves. Okay. Um, so this is very typical of what I would discuss with my customers when they're gonna use our products. Um, this is exactly how they're applying it in almonds and in walnuts. That's the shaker. This is their newest one, it's a side boom. They switched over when they started doing the tighter spacings to the side arm. So our irrigation systems have changed um, where we now have micro sprinklers and drip down the rows. We used to have flood and you could cross the borders to get around the trees easier. Um, but now you don't wanna go over your irrigation system. So this really prevents having to do that and makes it a lot more efficient. I think there's still a stigma out there that um, a lot of women can't be in ag, you can't be on the production side of ag, um, kind of go more towards the business side, and that's awesome too. There's a lot of different ways to go with it, and I think that this is one of the most welcoming and friendly industries. After that comes out of the field in the yellow retriever we looked at, it would come right over to here. This is the elevator, and it would actually have a, it has a side dump that goes into this receiving end, and this is what loads into the semis, so you just have a complete waterfall of almonds coming out the top of filling semi-trucks. It's pretty cool. 